Robbie Ginepri, congratulations. Another big scalp here at the French Open with the win of a Juan Carlos Ferrero. What were you doing in that match? I mean, you got up two sets of love, he came back in, you closed it out in five. Tell us about your experience. Yeah, I came out a little bit nervous today. Uh, kind of a big stage for me playing um, French Open champion, number one in the world. Uh, not Didn't know what to expect at the beginning. He kind of got up a break, but fought hard to uh, pull that first set out. And then uh, things kind of weren't going his way in the second and kind of cruised to that set. But uh, I knew he was going to make a charge the next few sets. You know, someone with that stature never gives up, and uh, he's extremely talented and fit. So I, it was a great, great win for me today. What did it feel like when that last point was finished? Yeah, it was uh, two long points to, to get to that match point, but uh, you know, I just kind of threw the hands up in the air and uh, it was very ecstatic. The year has, we, we discussed earlier, been a slow one for you and then things have really clicked into place over here. What, what's been the, uh, the factor? Just working hard and believing in myself and uh, fighting harder than the other guy across the net really has been the main thing here. Has, has it been difficult to get to keep that belief, to keep that motivation when the results on the, the, the tour itself have not been that great? Well, the results were, were you know, they weren't coming because of a few things, but uh, I've always been hitting the ball well this year. Um, you know, I never really lost the belief that I can get back to the top and play with the best guys in the world. So if, if you have that, then you're going to be okay. And one of those things that you're suggesting, I think, is, is the net problem that you had. Sure, yeah, and had some neck issues, but uh, feeling good now. All okay now? They are. What have you been doing here in Paris during the French Open, besides being on court? Yeah, not too much. Um, I haven't been able to really see much of the city. i um, just been resting and focusing on matches one match at a time. Well, the next one is against Novak Djokovic. What are your thoughts there? Yeah, we've played a couple times. Um, it's going to be a tough match. He's great off the ground. Um, going to have to think about what to do in the next couple of days and go out there and give him a good fight. What, what would be your initial thoughts on what you have to do? Are you going to share that? I don't know. Probably, probably not. I don't want to go and check out what I have to say about him. Well, Vigilepi, congratulations and good luck for that match. I appreciate and a it. chance for the quarterfinals of the French. Thank you.